How to Yu-Gi-Oh! And the topic of this video is Frequently Asked Questions. Question number one. What does bets stand for in Yu-Gi-Oh! Bets in Yu-Gi-Oh! stands for Bait Effects to Succeed. Question number two. How does one implement the bets system in Yu-Gi-Oh! To implement the bet system, let us give you a typical scenario that you will encounter in Yu-Gi-Oh! You, as a player, are trying to summon a monster. However, on the other side of the field, your opponent has a few set cards and their hand is full. So you feel one of their set cards may stop your play that you are going to initiate on this turn. What should you do? Well, you should, at this point in time, implement the bet system. First, you will B, bait, E, their effect, to succeed. After you have baited their effect, they will activate an effect in response to your bait. And once they've successfully been baited, you are therefore free, usually, to implement the things you would want to do on your turn. The bet system is usually effective when you know you have used the correct bait to bait out your opponent. That is when the bet system is effective. But how can you fully utilize the bet system so that your opponent will always fall for your bait? What is the way to do this? Before I continue to answer that question that you have, let me just say this. There is no way to always bait your opponent. However, what you can do is observe the field. Observe your environment. Observe the status of the game. And observe your opponent's condition. Their face, their body language. All these things can tell you the appropriate bait that you need to use at this time. If, let's say for example, you have higher life points and they have lower life points, then it dictates that the sets or cards they'll have in their hand will be to stop you from killing them. So they'll be defensive, possibly. So use bait that will disrupt the strategy, i.e. if you had less life points than your opponents, then they may, by logic, have aggressive sets or an aggressive cards in their hand. So you'd like to have cards or a form of a bait that would disrupt this strategy. Your bait needs to cater to the situation that you are currently in at that time as you are playing Yu-Gi-Oh! So that is what I can say will form the best bait. Utilize this system with what I have told you and you will, I am sure, become a Yu-Gi-Oh! Master. Question number three. Is an effect barrage a viable strategy of winning a duel in Yu-Gi-Oh! To answer this question, first let me explain to you what an effect barrage is. An effect barrage is using a multitude of effects to confuse your opponent so they do not know what to negate, so that you can activate cards in your turn freely without any interruptions from your opponent. Now, whether this is a viable strategy to win the duel, of course it is. However, it is not a strategy I would say that you can use all the time. It is the option to use out of necessity when you don't have some certain cards at some certain point in time in your duel at your disposal. It can help you give you that extra inch to victory, yes, but it needs to be used sparingly and there are times when this strategy can come and bite back at you in the backside. You are now one step closer to becoming a Yu-Gi-Oh! Master. My fate is in your hands.
like and subscribe, hate and subscribe. You could decide to not subscribe at all. The choice is yours. Goodbye.